Sports on the road in San Antonio for the Class 3A state semifinals. Number two, East Chambers taking their shot at top ranked Brock. Head coach Todd Sutherland calling for pressure before this one gets started. EC against a very large Brock team. That's Derek DeMoss with a spin move for two. Later on, East Chambers turning up the heat. There's that pressure Sutherland wanted. DeMoss with the steal. That leads to a fast break bucket for Ernest Caesar. This one was tied up at 22 at the half. Late in the third quarter, we're going to pick up the action. Bucks up by two. Scott Thomas from the top of the key, beating the buzzer. Eagles go up by one. That was a huge momentum shifter in the Alamo Dome. EC, though, they were hanging tough in the fourth. That's Cam Smith getting East Chambers within two points. Now, a game-changing moment coming up right here. Braden Smith going to hit the circus shot for the bucket and the foul. During the free throw, DeMoss was called for a technical foul. That gives Brock another possession and they're gonna take advantage. Thomas caps off a 7-0 outburst that gives Brock a 10 point lead. They win it by nine, 58-49. Goes with about 2-11 on the clock. They were definitely in the ball game. And it was a huge in one, followed up by a tech. Then we get the ball back again. It's a seven point screen right there. Do you know what happened on the technical? He said, he said that he pushed, he pushed off two hands on a dead ball. That's all I was told, which enough said. How tough was it to deal with Brock's size tonight? I mean, you definitely have an athletic team, but dealing with those bigs down below. Yeah, they caused problems. They caused even more problems than I thought in the first half. But then we made a run, and kind of, I thought we hit it under control a little bit and then, um, you know, made some adjustments to try to, Offset that, and we were really worried about their guards. And uh, but to me, the key play was the three to end the third. That was that was huge. Yeah. For some of these guys, it's our last ride. We've been playing together for a long time. I just want to apologize to those guys as a leader of this team. You know, just felt like we could have did more, but sometimes you just end up short. But I feel I have a lot of love for those guys and. I wish them uh, best of luck for the rest of their life. Congratulations, East Chambers, on an absolutely fantastic season. We're live in San Antonio. I'm Ashley Elam for 409 Sports.